community came together to remember Leah Jackson, a 15-year-old Bloom Carroll student who died in a car crash last Friday. NBC4's Sean Lanier spoke with Leah's father and her friends. He's live now at Bloom Carroll High School with how they are remembering her. Sean? Well, the candlelight vigil started out with a lot of laughs, but quickly turned somber because many people realized that they were remembering the life of a young 15-year-old cheerleader. I spoke with her father, who says that a vigil like this tonight really helps their family heal. I have never seen such an outpouring of support. There was a group of more than 100 students, faculty, friends, and family members at a candlelight vigil remembering the life of Leah Jackson. I just hope Leah's looking down and can see what's happening right now. Her father, Mike Jackson, says the family tries to remember the good times Leah brought them, but since he lost his 15-year-old daughter in that car accident, it's been difficult for them. We have our good days and bad days. Uh, you wake up every morning, you know, you, if you have kids, everybody knows what I'm talking about. Uh, you have that routine. And when you wake up and that routine is disrupted, um, it's very hard. But tonight was all about sharing the good moments Leah brought. She was such a fun person to just talk to and laugh with. The fun, unforgettable moment she had with her cheerleaders. We sat together on the bus, and every time I looked up, she'd be making a different funny face at me and just make me laugh. And I'm definitely going to miss that. And holding on to the essence of this happy teenager. She just wanted everyone to feel happy, and she was amazing. As the balloon soared into the sky in honor of Leah, her father walks away with a message for everyone to remember. Just cherish every moment. And her father also told me that the turnout tonight really made him proud of the impact his daughter had on this community. Looking for you outside Bloom Carroll High School, Sean Lanier, NBC4.